small town charm, big city perks, this town gets you close to Raleigh, Greenville, and the incredible North Carolina coast. It's a great place to raise a family with incredible schools, and if you haven't heard about Rocky Mount, today is your day. I'm Gretchen Coley. And I'm Isabella Wagley, and we're with the Coley Group. And today we are here to help you discover all the fabulous things there are about Rocky Mount. So Isabella, you came to Rocky Mount via a couple of big cities, New York and DC. Yep. What, what made you love Rocky Mount? Uh, so when I first came to Rocky Mount, um, my husband's family is from here, uh -huh. uh, the Walker family. They lived here for 120 years. That's a lot like mine. Yep. So my husband's family, the Coley family, um, has been here for I don't even know how long. It's been a long time, and my mother-in-law still lives here. Yes. You know, the school system is great, both public and mm -hmm. private. Um, there are so many activities mm -hmm. for kids to do, but the cost of living is truly affordable. Tell me a little bit about family-friendly activities here in Rocky Mount. So we have the Event Center, which is actually just across the street, and it's this great venue. It's got concerts and um, host meetings and all that, but it's got this great kids' area with a ropes course That's and cool. arcade. It's fabulous, yeah. Uh -huh. And then we're at the Imperial Center right now, and I want to take you guys inside to take a peek at this. Isabella, tell me what you love about the Imperial Center. Well, first of all, I love that they took an old factory and they turned it into something, I believe it was a tobacco factory. Mm -hmm. They turned it into something just truly educational and yeah. wonderful. They have plays, they have a planetarium, they have an art show exhibit um, area, um, and it's just really a fun place to bring kids any time of year. So one of the things I love the most about Rocky Mount is the history here. There is so much history. So much. So right now we're at Rocky Mount Mills, and this was in fact um, North Carolina's first cotton mill, founded in 1818. And what they did is they came in and they revitalized the whole area, um, and now it's all these microbreweries and restaurants. So I have some friends from Raleigh who come and stay at this tiny house hotel. Yep. Tell me a little about so that. So it's called River and Twine. Uh -huh. It's so sweet. I think it's eight tiny houses. They're so stinking cute. They're so cute. Yeah. And they each have fire pits outside. I love it. Yep. So I love West Haven. It's a historic district. Yeah. It's beautiful, big houses, tall yeah. trees. And we can't forget the fact that it's right off of 95. There's yep. several exits mm -hmm. into Rocky Mount, and it's the center point between New York and Miami, correct? Absolutely, yes. We hope that you've enjoyed this tour of Rocky Mount and what makes it special. And I love sharing the city that I've chosen to raise my family in. So if you have any questions or you're thinking about making a move to Rocky Mount or within Rocky Mount, make sure I'm your first phone call. We'll see you in Rocky Mount. All of our details are right here.